Burton, one of the seniors honored here tonight for the Scarlet Knights, and getting the start. Regular starter Dylan Shaver reached his maximum appearances and duels this year from what Coach Scott Goodell said last week as Britton works through off the defense, turning into offense, gets the takedown. Lewis trying to climb up the back. Britton trying to hit back in now. Yep, he's just going to try to step over. Going back for the head, turn in, take it down. There's three for Devin Britton. A tech fall on senior night. He's going to win this one 15 to nothing. Dominant. In 339, there's a look at the winning takedown. Really nice scramble out of it, too. Lewis got in deep. Britton just. Shot here from Peterson on that low single leg. Garber fighting it. Peterson gets through and drives for the double. He's got three. First period there. There's the opening takedown for Peterson, leading this one three to one. Garber able to get a foot free, backing on a shot here towards the boundary. Now looking for a takedown of his own, and he's got three. Holy smokes. All of a sudden, you stop wrestling, and that's what happens. Riding time point, and Peterson, maybe a little lack of days ago there. We're going to go to sudden victory. Peterson seat on his butt. He initiated the attack, trying to clear a leg driving through. For three, he has got it. And Dean Peterson's going to win this one in sudden victory three. As we take a look at Peterson's winning takedown right there, just clearing the leg and switching off. Taking on William Morrow for Bloomsburg, a sophomore. Oof! What a that slide by. That was really quick from Weaver. Can't get the score bug graphic up that fast. And he's going to drive him down for three. See if he get that foot free. Morrow trying to jack this one up. It's way high. On his head. Was well, some flexibility by Dylan Weaver. Weaver to the ground. And Morrill's going to be able to finish this takedown, 4-3. Nice slide by again from Weaver. Has control behind, there's a takedown. That's the second time he's hit that, man. It's been very deadly when he's hit it. Courtesy of another slide by. Yeah, his slide bys have been great tonight. That's the second one of the match. Alex Jean's driving, he's got the one leg, has the ankle. Chetta still fighting, and there's three for Cade Balestrini. Chetta dove back in on a shot, it turned into a single, and now his head's caught, but he's trying to step through, he does. And Chetta takes a 4-3 lead. Got 20 seconds to do so. Alex Jean's left arm still in there, and Chetta comes around for another takedown. Gets three, he's up 10-3. Territory, now look at that last takedown. Yeah, Balestrini shot, but just immediately. Back to work on his feet. Good shot here from Balestrini. He's got the single leg, trying to grab both legs. Try to hit him back in. He'll drive, and he's got a takedown. And cuts the lead, 10 to 6. Balestrini's going to need multiple takedowns. Chet had re-attacked. Good slide by here. And he'll drive him back down for three. It's 14 to 6, and now he's going to cut him. That ball. He got it. A lot of takedowns there. Here you see one of them. Riding time point is locked for Chetta. Right back in on a shot. He's got the single leg, trying to switch off to a double. He does. 17-7 now. Switching off to a double here on the edge of the mat. Hop back over, get his foot free. He does. Switching off to a double and somehow staying in bounds, Matt. Gets another take. He's up 20 to 8. Stall warning on Balestrini. That's going to be a point for Chetta, and he's going to get the takedown as well, 24 to 9. That's going to do it with a tech fall. Michael Chetta. We're at 157 now, Dylan. Soldano spinning around to the back, and he's got a takedown. He's up 3 nothing. Really nice spin there from Soldano. So quick. Trying to hit back into DeRosa. We saw something similar last week as DeRosa tries oh, to hop no, over Soldano. Gonna go oh. with him. Oh, he's gonna lock up a half Nelson. He's gonna get up on top, looking for the fall now is Soldano. Soldano trying to sink this one in, looking to stick him. The Rosa fighting. Soldano wraps it up, he's got the fall in the second period. Hurrah here at Jersey Mike's Arena. Taking on Nolan Ziegler. 
stopped Hurley immediately. Tried to go for a big move as well. And Ziegler counters it for a takedown. He's up 3-0. Jolie going to be able to roll through. Now ending up on top. And this is where he's just so dangerous. Danger call coming for the moment. And now Turley is going to adjust for the takedown. Now for the fall. He's got it. Jackson Turley, a fall on senior night. And the Rutgers up 28 to 5. There you see it there. He just tipped over and then got. You see the quick pin there. There it is. Did not weigh in tonight. So they gave Gayer the nod. Just to jack up. He's oh, no. Now Dobbins catches him. Gayer's going to watch out here. Look at that again. He just got stuck there, Matt. Yeah, he just kind of collapsed on himself. Shot here from the flank. Single leg. Good one there for a trip. Trying to drive on Colucci. Colucci's still fighting it off. And yet, flank behind. He's got a, a takedown and a 4 nothing lead. That take down there, and then he immediately went head hunting. Did Epperly is five and six this year for the Scarlet Knights. Searching for that single leg, coming out the back. He's got a takedown as Kyle Epperly gets the opening takedown of the match. 145 to go in the first period of three to one. Just look at that takedown. Yeah, just like a shot from Levens and scroll from Epperly. And a spin behind. Grabbing that far leg, he's going to take down and Kyle Epperly is up 7-2.